Hello guys, how are you doing? Please do let me know in the comments if you're in any way excited about the upcoming Call of the Wild Angler game. If you have any questions at all, ask me in the comments and I'll do my utmost to answer them for you. And if you want gameplay, then check out Sim UK Ultimate Realism. I've uploaded a ton of gameplay footage over there. I also made a beginner's guide on Sim UK Review, so be sure to check that out too if you don't know what you're doing. Expansive World sent me an early pre-release build version of Call of the Wild The Angler, which releases on the 31st of August 2022 on Steam, Epic and the Microsoft Store, with a console version coming a little later. So all the footage I'm about to share with you today in this video is from the pre-release version. Now you'll already know that The Angler is made by the same dev team who made the Hunter Call of the Wild game, and you will already know that it's the first fully open world fishing experience that's ever released, with more than 25 kilometers squared of hills, mountains, forests, and of course lakes, ponds, and rivers for you to explore and enjoy, with the odd cave and waterfall thrown in for good measure. And as the unique selling point, I can say that it totally transforms your fishing experience. There are, at the moment, 12 beautifully recreated species of fish, and you will definitely have fun battling with these aquatic lifeforms. But this is not the main reason why I think you should add the angler to your wish list. The main reason for me is the freedom to have fun. And I'll show you exactly what I mean by that in a moment. When Expansive World sent me the key, I spent my first three hours or so completing the tutorial, exploring the massive open world environment and unlocking fast travel locations, collecting coins, parchments and completing a few additional tasks for the warden. But it is only when I got given permission to stress test the server and I invited as many of my friends who could join me, then we started coming up with some fun games and things to do to just see how well the servers could cope. And I must say that the servers coped very well indeed. It was then that the massive open world fishing experience really made perfect sense. You will never have more fun in any other fishing game than you will in Call of the Wild The Angler, and I think it will change your perspective on fishing games from this point on. I'm going to share with you now some clips showcasing some of the fun that we've had, and I want to know exactly what you think about the game after you've watched it. Thank you. <laughs> okay, is everyone here? Yeah. Yeah. Jimmy, Jimmy, Jimmy. Okay, right, I'm going to count down from three, and then I'm going to say go. When I say go, we go, okay? Okay. Go! I knew it! You cheeky punk! I like your shades, buddy. At least he's wearing clothes today. <laughs> Alan, come back, man! <laughs> Where's he going? He's cheating. Alan's disqualified. Oh my god, this is bad. Ah, shenanigans incoming. Mike, you dirty scoundrel. Interesting right. to see how it handles right. alt vehicles as well. Right. Though. server with all these cars. Right. Three, two, one go. Somebody tripped Jimmy over. <laughs> Where's my you boat? See, oh my god. You all see my t shirt, by the way? Yeah, yes. beautiful. Oh, my kind of why? My Just boat's disappeared. Oh, are you joking? The boats have gone. The boats have gone. Here. I don't mind. I think mine's, mine's there. Mine's there. Look at this. You can slip stream. Not if I do this, you can't. <laughs> Uh, uh. It's a race between you two now. Oh, Spike not there yet. I yeah, I think I've... Win. I flip it! Oh, unbelievable. Good job, Spike. I level with anything. <laughs> oh, brilliant. <laughs> and I kicked my car and ran back to it as well. What are you all doing? <laughs> all right, last uh, one has to, has to go naked. Yeah, that's that. Okay, all right. Lunges. That's fair. Sure, Good job, boys. He's on. got one. He's it's actually got one. It. Finally. Yes, it's a tiddler. Hey. It's, a, it's a tiddler, but it's it's there. It's a fish. Uh, you got that. Good. Well, well, a catch is a catch. <laughs> a catch is a catch, exactly. Good man, good man, you did it in the end. Now <laughs> take your trousers off. <laughs> One point difference, 27, 26. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Yes, yes. Nope. You got one, Wobbly? Yes. Uh, good man. Trout, £2.29. That's a good one as well. We got that one. That's fish and chip status. One minute, 30 seconds, everyone. We're dead level, 27 all. Oh, oh my god, I believe it. Dead level. I got one. <laughs> nice. Golden trout. Oh no, it's Jimmy. Well done. That's 28, well, 27. Well done, Jimmy. Fish on. 
she's in. 4.13 golden trout, all even again, 28 apiece. Come on, come on, come on, come on, you beast. Come on, come get it. Come get it, you monster. Oh my god! Yeah. Oh my god! What have you got, Jimmy? Oh my god! Oh my god! It's a late count, he's 19.6. How many other games make you scream and shout that loud? How cool is that? Not too many. Not too many. That's real joy, that is, man. Yeah. Fishing will do that to you. Mike, you started this madness. I did. This is all Mike. my fault. Yeah. Guys, it's not letting me take my clothes off. <laughs> Sorry, I it, mate, I'm afraid. So, am I right or am I right? Fishing with friends is just so much better and it's the freedom that Call of the Wild the Angler gives you which really boosts that and just, oh my gosh, we have had such a giggle. These guys are absolutely fantastic and thank you to each and every one of them for helping me make these videos. But I hope that you agree. Let me know in the comments below. The good news is that Expansive Worlds are well known for their long and dedicated product support and I'm 100% confident to say that the angler is just going to get better and better and the quality of the fishing is already very high with decent battles on offer as you progress through the equipment upgrades that are available. Even with your little 1 meter starter rod and float, you're still going to have some great battles. Now Taylor's hard sell shop, as I like to call it, has a wide range of various rods, reels, lines, hooks, baits, lures and more to spend all that hard earned money on. You've seen the jeeps and the boats in action already and you have seen what you can do with them. I have uploaded loads more content unedited for you to just check out what the game really is like and I think you're going to find it to be very rewarding indeed. Character customization is something I usually don't care very much about, but again, because of the experience that we've had and the fun that we're having, we actually started to designate special t-shirts, like in Tour de France, so that only the winner of our competitions can wear them. And as the winners change, that right is passed on to them. And that really just adds a little something special there. Now, getting naked was a bit of a uh, uh, last place position reward but uh, sometimes we couldn't do it. Stripping down to your underpants just seemed like a funny way to punish somebody who couldn't catch a fish. Now, Call of the Wild, the Angler releases on August the 31st on PC, Steam, the Epic Store, and the Microsoft Store, so wishlist it now, guys. Honestly, you won't regret it. The console release is yet to be confirmed, but I hope it won't be too long, because in my mind, the cross-compatible multiplayer experience is something that everybody should get to enjoy. Thank you so much. Please hit that like button. Don't forget to leave me a comment and subscribe for future of the wild the angular content five meters get in here seriously yes wow 6.5 kilograms 8822 points man that was that was a battle and a half that was